Raising bees is a great way people can have a hobby, produce honey, and have a global impact on the health of our world. But it can be complicated, too. The Broodminder Wireless Beehive Monitor System helps make some of the hard stuff easy. Let's dive in and discover how easy and intuitive it is. While waiting for your Broodminder to arrive, you can load the Broodminder app on your phone or tablet. Start by going to the App Store on your phone and load the app. If you're using iOS, it is simply named Broodminder. If you're using Android, the app is named Broodminder Lite. After you receive your Broodminders and unpack them, we need to turn them on. Let's start with the Broodminder Temperature and Humidity Monitor. As you look at the Broodminder TH, you'll notice the green circuit board at the bottom with its unique ID number. This number will be helpful in a moment. To activate the battery, simply pull the ID tab out from the device. You'll see a light flash one time that indicates it is now operating. You can stick the ID tab on the other end if you wish. This makes later identification easier. Now to start the scale, you'll notice its unique ID number on the right-hand end that will allow you to easily find it on your phone. Simply slide off the green sleeve to separate the parts of the scale. The bottom aluminum piece supports the scale while protecting it from the elements. Keep these parts, they will be used in a moment. Picking up the wooden piece of the scale, you'll notice plastic coverings. These protect the sensors and should remain on the device when installed. Locate the circuit board and the battery. Press the battery into the socket. You'll see a light flash one time that indicates the scale is now operating. Replace the bottom aluminum support with the flat side toward the wooden part and be sure to replace the green sleeve. Now you're ready to install your Broodminder monitoring system. The Broodminder temperature and humidity monitors should be installed directly above the hive's brood. Typically, this is the lower one or two hive boxes. Lift up the box and place the temperature and humidity monitor inside with the word Broodminder up and the white tab sticking out. Then gently set the box back into place. To install the scale, we recommend placing 2x4s or a piece of 2-inch angle under the front and back of the hive to make sliding in your Broodminder easy. Gently lift the hive and slide the scale into place. You can remove the support if needed. Also, you can use a hive tool or crowbar for heavy hives. For more accurate results, we suggest that you review our user guide for configuration suggestions and tips. That's all there is to installation. Now open the Broodminder app. It will immediately begin looking for the sensors that you just installed. Once found, tap the black text. Press the sync button in the lower left of the screen and the app will retrieve all of the hourly observations made by your Broodminder. Once the data is retrieved, the app will ask you if you would like to upload the data to the cloud. Although not required, we highly suggest that you do this in order to share your data with the world. You'll be prompted to enter your apiary's zip code only. We keep specific hive location private. Once you have retrieved the data, you can use the app to review and share it. It is available on your phone, or if you upload it to the cloud, it will also be on mybroodminder.com. You can learn about data interpretation at becounted.org, where you will also be able to view public domain measurements from all of our citizen scientists. That's it. Now you are a part of the Broodminder Hive Monitoring Movement. At Broodminder, we believe that every hive counts.